Hey everyone, Pale Sam here with another little video. Please like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. Uh, I've alluded to this uh, topic in some other videos, but I wanted to do a little video specifically on it. There's been a lot of criticism uh, for the Rams not drafting an O lineman in the uh, in the 2021 NFL draft. I will admit to being one of those people that was shocked by this decision. I really thought it was a position of need. And, and pretty much any article you read listed it as a position of need. However, we have to remember these columnists, these journalists, um, and, and even us fans, we don't see what's going on in the Rams building. Uh, the Rams have drafted a number of old linemen in the previous drafts. Um, and though we lost uh, some in, in, in this free agency uh, period, I think it's important to remember that there's a reason we lost those and that the Rams are willing to let them go. If they didn't feel their production could be matched by someone in-house or someone they'd get in the draft, they wouldn't have let them go. So I, I'm I'm willing to read uh, Sean McVay's defense of not drafting an old lineman uh, article in description below, as always, and uh, by Cameron De Silva. De Silva, sorry if I pronounced your name wrong, Cameron. But uh, yeah, it's a great article, and it just uh, you know. A quote from it is uh, from McVeigh. It says, There's a lot of depth with the 11 players we have in the room today. All of them have played meaningful games. Uh, so, in other words, that does you know show they have confidence in those players that they have NFL experience and they would rather stick with what they have than try and, and draft someone that they have to develop. And that's not a terrible mindset. Absolutely we can criticize them as fans. We can have fun, but I'm still going to cheer for these guys. I, I, you know, I hope they they get better. And and any criticisms that we've had of, of of some of these players, you know, we have to remember players do get better sometimes. Uh, that's that's part of being a professional and and making that jump from college into the NFL. And the Rams have been pretty good at developing talent. So let's hope that some of these young linemen can really, you know take hold of this opportunity and you know keep that pocket nice and clean for Maddie Stafford to just drop some dimes across the field to all these amazing new receivers we have <laughs> and of course are the ones that we already have on the roster anyway thanks for watching let me know in the comments below are you still disappointed that we didn't take an alignment or are you buying what McVeigh is saying please like comment subscribe all that jazz payout time peace and out